is your host, Lost in Character, and today I'm going to be playing Dragon Fist Kung Fu using real Wing Chun in VR. But if you want to join me for the first time, please give the channel a follow. I'm streaming on Twitch and YouTube, and uh, yeah, been loving this game recently. Just got the new Ip Man character, unlocked him finally. These are the uh, wooden dummy forms. It's a little hard to do in VR, but... Started, started wrong side. Right. <laughs> side whatever you get the idea I'm going to uh, actually I don't think I'm on this level I have uh, got a different level let's see where am I at so I thought you had to beat the Ip Man character to unlock him um, apparently that's not true actually this is switched up it says 65 to unlock now. Last time it was like 20 something. And uh, they must have switched things around, but nevertheless, they gave me the character. So that's sweet. His special move is to do the chain punches, which I'll show you once I get there. And we're getting in a bar fight with this chick. Very interesting get up there. All right. Let's go. Let's fix my pad. And fight. Leave now before I throw you out. Let's see what style she uses. She's big. Let me get my bearings. Got to warm up a bit. That's a perfect tanda. She is always attacking on this left side. Perfect for a tanda. Ugh. Oh, she got me. I let her get in too close. Shit. All right. Oh, my hands got a little caught up, but... Oh, 
that's bullshit. Woo. Here, take a take a plate and a bowl. Get out of my shop. Come here so I can hit you. Oh, that's bullshit. She always leads off with those two moves. So there's two two moves I suggest using that work really well. There's Tan Da, which is the Tan for defense, and uh, Da is like a hit. So you're doing it at the same time. So if it's coming on the on your left side, you attack that way. If it's coming on your right, attack that way. Uh, I guess, I suppose you can also attack on the outside. So that's Tan Da, and then Gan, which is the cutting, cutting hand. I think it's cutting hand, or cultivating arm, something. Um, so same way as the Tanda, you have the Ganda, which is for low attacks. So with that, you can pretty much do anything. There is Buda, which is essentially like Tan, but it's a little higher. So I suggest using a version of this to defend your, which 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 either any side really. And I'll try to make a video eventually showing that, maybe in slow motion, or how to practice it so you can implement it in the game. Because there's also shifting of the body. Oh. Kicking is just... throws me off. Sleeves. All right. What I get two stars on her. Two stars. I'll take it. Ooh, red flower cult. Let's do it. Let's drink some red flower Kool Aid. Hello, anyone there? But if you do like martial arts and you have a VR system, definitely check out my YouTube channel, it's Lost in Character. I've got a couple videos showing you how to use fencing techniques in VR and how to defend your body. Ooh, this guy looks pretty badass. I like his little teeny sunglasses and this long goatee. You look very cliche, sir. Fa Feng. Ooh, and you have the evil laugh. What's next? Are we gonna finally drink that, that Kool-Aid? That Kool-Aid potion? All right, what do you got? What do you got, old man? I'm gonna read your moves for a second. This guy played defensive? Just kick her. So he's doing this Shaolin shit. Oh, that was hit on him. Nice, nice. Alright, we 
what you got, old man? Maybe you're not very old. Should have blocked on that side. These barely hit me. Poxow. Palm thrust to the face. Oh, what do you got? Some magic? You're a poison guy. I knew it. Tanda uh, reverse that time, but luckily that still hurts him. You stab him with those fingers. This guy isn't too hard, really. <laughs> he likes to throw the left lead hand a lot, or his left, you know. Ah. See, the simple Tanda. Tanda, Buda, or Ganda works every time. Alright, get away from those stupid statues. Oh, it broke his glasses. Ah, sorry, I'm not gonna pay for those, but, you know. Oh, you got me with that one. to the nuts. Alright, old man. What you got? Ah. So I shifted the wrong way. Alright, I can get three stars on this on this jabroni. That was a good view, Dow. There, you saw how that blocked his uh, almost hook, hook-like move. There we go. So the idea was with Wing Chun. So we use body shifting a lot. So if you're defending a move with this hand, shifting back for the defense side and you're shifting your body forward on the other side and attacking, you're basically attacking and defending at the same time with one motion. And uh, it's, it takes a while to train that, but it's def definitely effective in this game because they can only do so much to you at once. man
Damn. Three stars on that one. Guess I'm finally warmed up. Of course, you have the your standard forms of Wing Chun, Sidlam Tao, which is a little idea form. And then, you know, it goes to the second section. Not a bad bong sow. I mean, it drops the elbow. It's a little strange, but it's there. And you got Chum Q. Involves a lot more motion. <laughs> I don't even know how to do it with the camera. There we go. That one's a little harder to record, but I'll probably do some of that later, another video. But for now, let us fight. This person, girl, I think it's a girl. Lay Thai. Okay, this must be like Muay Thai stuff, maybe. This looks, looks like a, a scene of a movie or something. Lots of rain in, in Thailand, I guess. Okay, let me straighten this out. I'm far enough away from all the boundaries. Okay. Let's go Chingami Yip. It's Amy Yip with Ching. You're not a, you're not a Yip. I will teach you some respect. Where are you? Knee kick. Oh, I can't move my arms. And stay down. What you got? King of the circle. <laughs> when you get a little too close to him, it seems like almost wrestling a little bit. Everything gets hung up. So I suggest staying a little bit of a distance, okay. Can't pay attention. Get back. Foul beast. Oh, I shut that shit down.
Oh, is she trying to pull pie me? Oh, you sneaky snake bastard. I just hear money. I don't want to lose money. You took my third star, you bitch. I'm a sidestepper. Oh yeah, she's done with that one. Fuck your stupid move. That's a pretty good exchange. <laughs> Damn. There's one move, uh, especially where you pull them and kick. You can't really do pulls in this game, I don't think. Could try it out next time, depending on how hard the dude is. Ooh, it's like a ninja guy. Sweet. Okay, so I fought the three ninjas before. <laughs> three ninjas. Uh, now I got to do this. Koga. Stupid sleeves. I don't want to stay rolled because of my fists of fury. Can't be too tight because I want to be loose and agile. All right. I will power you, Carol. All right, Shiroi Hokori. Yo, hi, Lo. What is this shit? Oh, you son of a bitch. Back to the fire. Keeping this guy at a distance, so I figure out his weird fucking moves. How are you not dead? Oh, I just broke his neck. Alright, you son of a bitch, it's on. No more of that weird ass shit. Where'd you fucking go? 
Shadow Boxer. Come back to the real world, you son of a bitch. See your weird twisting moves. So I just have to hit you. There you go, bitch. So it doesn't work when you're as close or you get your arms hung up. can't really pull, it doesn't seem like, unless there's a button for that. Just have to grip him. Oh, elbowed him right in the neck. Would have hurt. Oh, I got my move. Sweet. Good Tonda. Should have defended myself going in. Maybe I did grab him. Nut shot. <laughs> all right, all right. Three stars on him, too. Where is he? Ninja camp. Three stars on him, too. Ooh, all right. This guy or girl. Whew. A little sweaty. All right, let's do it. <laughs> so I do train uh, Wing Chun at a local school, West County Wing Chun in St. Louis. <clears throat> um, Sifu Dennis Moreland has trained with Ip Ching, Ip Man's son. Uh, if you remember from the movie, he's a little kid. And uh, yeah, I mean, the guy that Dennis, uh, Sifu Dennis Moreland Learned from Chris Damiano. He worked with Ip Ching as well and started the uh, Ip Ching Wing Chun Society organization. So I am uh, learning from that lineage, the direct line to Ip Man. And yeah, it's been great. It's a lot of fun. Makes playing this game a lot more fun too, especially with all the new content that's been added. Um, I haven't done the multiplayer yet. I've actually been waiting uh, till I get the Ip Man character, which I thought I had to unlock. Now I have it, so I'm just trying him out. I don't. Where's the? Uh, 
Am I facing off again against one of these people again? Let's see where I'm actually supposed to go. Alright. Okay, so there is a third guy that's not the other dude in the hat. Lots of hats, and probably the shadiest map suspect. Okay, so... Not those two. I went over there. Anything over here? No? Oh, I can run! Sweet! Did not know that. That might be a new feature. I might have just never tried it. Okay, well, I'm supposed to... Here, here we go. I'm stupid. I'm an idiot. Three of them. Flying blades. Alright, well, looks like I'll be fighting with some blades. At least against some blades. This oh, is your last oops. Chance. Leave now or, or forever now. hold your peace. Like sit up on the rock right as she was going for my nuts. to the bamboo or the fence. going on. Ah, oh, get me out of this shit. Alright, they're all still alive somehow. I've managed to defeat almost all of them individually. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. No fucking blades. Some of you other guys have to have some blades. Alright, the final dude. Let's, let's go into the forest where I can see you. You're about to pull out a blade, aren't you? Get on that rock and die. Sweet. Okay. Let's see if we got time for some more. Alright, now these are the Shaolin guys. Very effective, but 
pretty much takes 40 years or something to to master a style in Shaolin. A little too long for me. Wing Chun doesn't really have many forms. It only has uh, five or seven, if you count the weapons or how you break it up. Essentially three forms, a dummy form that's sometimes broken into two. But uh, yeah, pretty simple martial art, but it is I must defend, um, an advanced way to move, a combat system. It's unnatural, and that takes a while to learn. This is the Dragon Ball Z, dude. Cohen, or... Crowen. that easy tansa or tanda oh can we go here let's fight next to the buddha we can we can I'm in your temple, what you gonna do about it? I didn't spend 40 years to walk up here. Oh, you're not allowed to come because you haven't completed 40 years? Suck it. I'll always be better than you. And now I'm just, I'm tired of waiting. If you can't go in your own sacred temple, you're not gonna do anything about me going in. What kind of martial artist are you? Yeah, that's a nut shot. So when he goes real low, I would suggest almost Ganda, but a low ton for the purposes of the game works. That was high low gun. It's kind of a chop or defensive block. And uh, chop high and chop low. Works well for defending your whole body. Oh yeah, you're giving me three stars all day. I'm sorry to disrespect you in your own temple. I don't know that's what you're gonna do. Oh, I tripped him hard with that kick. Perfect gun, duh. I look gun. This guy is pretty freaking easy. trick to doing chain punches is to stay relaxed and oh oh you some okay you're going down bitch yeah trick of a uh, the chain punches 
harder with controllers. You have to make a, basically what, essentially what you're doing is you're punching in a circle and you're recycling that hand under kind of like this. Um, you want to be relaxed when you throw this. You can practice that by throwing out with a palm, not a clenched tight fist and see how much your, your arm is going to want to, your hand's going to want to shake because you, you, you throw the energy, but then you release it. So it's not tense. It doesn't like hit the end of your reach and rock your joints here. So that is the kind of motion that gets you good at doing these things um, without getting tired and doing it effectively. Also chain punching is that same relaxed kind of thing. So just get used to doing punching like this, but release your punches. Don't clench your fists. Just kind of get, use kind of like a you know, monkey paw kind of grip, but very loose. Practice that and you'll get better at chain punches. You can use the Ip Man character and wail on them. You can step forward to keep it going. Just make sure you don't run into the wall or punch anything sharp or, you know. So, this guy. All right. I just defeated the top student. Now time for the master. All right. Buddha bless you. Oda. Oh, Buddha. Not, not, oh, duh. Oh, duh, it's Buddha. All right, let's see your moves. Still doesn't beat my tanda. Ah. Oh, he gets in close. Oh, he got me with that one. Should have had my hands up. You always kind of want your hands out in front, especially in this game, because your whole arm is a barrier. It's not just your palms. Which is one, one reason I like this game. And one reason a Tonda actually works. Bam. Because at the time you're actually blocking with your your forearm, not your hand. Ah oh, shit! <laughs> Fuck that one up. It's too far away. Best time to do that move is when they're coming at you. And you already have this hand, <laughs> this uh, position open. Just wait for them to open up. Man, they can't stop the Tonda. What you got? Nope, oh, okay, okay. You got something. Oh, that was a nice fuck to the throat. Fuck so. Alright. 
I don't know how many chain punches this let, let, lets me get, but I'm definitely hurt from that guy. Start using my kicks. Almost had my move. Oh, pressure point. Ah, yeah, he got me. This guy's a little aggressive. He gets his hits in all close up, but it's no match. He won't hurt. He won't get another star out of me. Especially when I do with that. Oh, you're trying to poke me in the eye, huh? I don't even know what your special move is. Damn it. See, step forward too much with that move in slow motion, you get a really powerful hit against you. Doop. I've defeated all of your students and the master. Alright, let's see. We got time for maybe one more here. One more. Oh. Boxing arena. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Yes, I'm in this corner. Standing five foot ten, perhaps nine. All right. Um, this dude, we got Clayton Hughes. All right. All right. Ready to face the champ, buddy. Champ, huh? I would use the kick in this game to throw up on you, especially if your hands are getting stuck. That's just their style. Use that kick when they get too close. Oh shit. Silliest looking kick I've ever seen. Oh. Oh, shit. I 
Pancakes are more effective, bitch. All right, he goes down in the third round. Supposedly, maybe the fourth. Let's see how I do. Cuts. Ah, oh, he gets those fists and then he boxes you in. Are you not entertained? Tiny people. Anyway, I'm gonna uh, have to stop for now. Gotta go pick up my girlfriend from work. Thank you for joining. Definitely click the subscribe button if you're watching on YouTube and follow if you're on the Twitch channel, if you're into that kind of thing. And uh, stay tuned for more martial arts and VR. Thanks for watching. Austin character out. Damn it, my thing for.